With the continual rise of unemployment and uncertainty of those currently employed, vocational education has been identified as a major key to ending this menace. This was the call when Stephen Osenwege led the youth in Benin City, the Edo State Capital, to the Secretariat of the Labour Party to indicate his desire to seek for the party's governorship ticket. Edo State and Nigeria is not in isolation. We are part of the global community. So young children in Edo State should be learning what they are learning in Japan. They should be learning what they are learning in New York. It's because we are together in this world. We should not be having substandard level of training and facility in our schools. So my idea is simple. Let our education meet the standard of the global community and also introduce skills acquisition to our education. Because I believe that at the end of secondary school, you should have a skill. Because what I found when I lived uh, in the United States was most of them have hand skills beyond just theory. So why not we put woodwork, electrical work, plumbing into the, uh, in the curriculum? So that when you finish, you don't want to go to university, you can start a trade. And the government will invest in that. Another thing is employment. At those days, the largest resources we have is human capacity. Human capital is being underutilized. We have the most vibrant, young, dynamic people. You enter a hospital in New York, one of the best doctors there is an Edo person. You are in the hospital bed, the nurse there, the leader of the nurse is an Edo, Edo person. Those people are waiting to come back and come and invest in our state and help to bring Edo state into a prosperous life. Uh, as an aspirant, a Labour Party has not concluded on anybody as of today. I will also make it clear that it is solely what is right Labour Party will do from this point. No more, no less. A level playing ground will be placed at the front of all aspirants that are here, you know, uh, to aspire with a view to uh, being elected via primaries as candidates of the party in 2024. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.